dot to string to make sure it should return the string and then just save it now let's run the application Okay, now let's write something inside this loop. And click on this button. You can see that the value you have accessed from the first, you can retrieve in the second. This time I'm not using the bundle concept, but I'm trying to access the data from where? From my shared preference file. So I'm using the shared preference file for storing the data. There's data which I have stored is the first the first edit text in the first screen where I was writing something I was storing the data inside my shared preference and then I am accessing the same shared preference to retrieve the data on my second screen this concept is clear is it clear so far okay is it clear for Nikita? Is it clear for Mitali, Ashish, everyone? Is it clear for you all? If you have any questions, please do ask. Okay. Nikita wants to go to the previous code. Fine. You can just have a look at the code, you can understand it. I have done a very simple thing. I have created a shared preference at the top here. Then after creating this shared preference, I came down. In the shared preference, I write a file name with which I, want to, I wanted to create this shared preference. And then I have kept some of the values inside it. Like I have kept the edit text value which I was retrieving from the first activity inside my shared preference. Once that is done, I pass the intent just to move over. I've got a question from Mitali. Mitali saying that can you develop a calculator after this? Definitely Mitali, you can develop a simple calculator obviously with the help after this class as you have already seen that how you can transact the data from one activity to other and how you can use the click listener actually everything you can definitely create it at any point of time if you face difficulty do get in touch with our support guys they will help you to assist ahead with the same okay now everyone has understood this concept Let's move to our next point.